Hey you guys, I'm back. I'm sorry I haven't posted any videos lately because obviously I had my baby facing me on Snapchat. Um, for two days I was having some signs of labor and one day um, I actually had my baby on December 15, 2017 at 7.30 at night. So basically I had my baby on that day. I'm going to give you a backstory of just that day. This is my labor and delivery story. Um... I'm going to be inserting some pictures from my labor and delivery. I didn't videotape it because at that time I was like, yeah. oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. At that time I was in some shock. So, I didn't know what the fuck to do. So, basically, let's get right on into the video. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing that. No, I don't know how to edit that shit like that. <laughs> Stupid. But okay, I'm just playing on my belly button. And I'm gonna be showing y'all the flatness girl. Y'all remember I was so big with the flatness, and yes, my stomach is black because I don't know. I've been trying to, I've been on YouTube how to lighten stomach. Stomach. After having a baby, look lately. Having a baby. Like, I've been lately. But I'll just go focus on that later. But yes, my stomach is kind of black and then it's like I'm light skin at the top. But y'all see that. And then I'm going to be showing y'all little fat mama. Right now she don't got no, she only has a diaper on because she was hot in her um sleeper. So I took it off her and I'm letting her cool down. So yeah, but let's get in the video. For three, two days, I was having signs of labor. One day I was at work, they sent me to the hospital because my contractions was like very bad. But then that whole day, um, I went from two centimeters to five centimeters within a couple hours. Then they sent me home. I didn't go to work the next day because I was not feeling it. They sent me home at like five o'clock in the morning. And, um, no, I wasn't, I wasn't going for it, going to work after that, and I'll be super tired, aggravated, still having these same contractions. I was like, no. So, the day after that, which is the 14th, went to work. I'm still having the same contractions, but I'm maintaining, like, I'm breathing through them, and I'm really not doing as much as I usually do. So, basically, um... Um, that whole day I was just chilling at work and wasn't doing much. Next day, which is the 15th, this is the big day where little mama came. So, 7.30 in the morning, um, I usually get up and go pee. 7.30 comes, oh, I'm like, oh, I gotta pee. Gush of water comes out, and I'm like, did I just pee on myself? No. I'm still got the urge to go pee. So, the gush of water comes out, mucus plug is with it. I'm like, but I'm like, it's not clicking in my head that I just, my water just broke. I'm like, wow. So, it got on my bed, so I'm running to the bathroom. Like, I literally ran the fastest, me being pregnant, and that's me running that fast to the bathroom. Child, call me Usain Bolt, because I was boom. I was out, straight to the bathroom. My brothers peed. One of them peed on the seat, so I had to clean it. I had to give them a little bleach. I had to wipe it off. As I'm wiping it off, more water comes out. And I'm like, oh, what the fuck? It's all on the floor, on the rug. I'm like, ugh. 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 
this is coming out, so, um, I just peed, stand up, more water, white, blood, ugh, call my mama, she ain't pick up, call my sister, she ain't pick up, call my other sister, she pick up, she tell me that my water's broke, you're in labor, blah, 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 get your bag packed, put some clothes on, go to the hospital, boom, that's what I did, but, I changed my pants twice because my water broke twice. Then, then my brother's car, my, my water still coming out. At least I had three towels to sit on. I didn't ruin your seats, bruh. <laughs> I'm fucking retarded. But yeah, get to the hospital. So my water broke. They um, sent me up to OGB triage. Once I get to OGB triage, um... They're like, yeah, your service froze in your five centimeters. Gonna get you in the labor delivery room in just an hour. Cause I'm setting up for you. Do, 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 do. I'm like, cause it was trash. Just had my face looking like this. And I'm like, okay. Cause I wanted to cut everybody out. And everybody was getting on my motherfucking nerves. And I'm like, Okay. So basically, um, after that, they sent me up there, and I'm just like walking around my room. My brother, um, left to um go get my mom. My mom came up. My brother went to work, and this is about the time I get got my own room. So, got my own room, time passed by, I ain't, by the time passing by, I'm doing my squats, I'm in the bathroom, I ate that little nasty vegetable broth, um, I was on the phone with my sisters while I was having contractions, um, texting my baby daddy, telling him I'm going to labor, he was like, where you at, I'm like, I'm at the hospital, do you not comprehend, he was like, okay, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm like, okay, okay, okay. I stopped texting people because I was getting mad annoyed because people nurses coming in, they calling and texting me. I was getting annoyed, so I stopped answering phone calls. I turned my phone off and all that stuff. So then, um, good old seven twenty five came around. This is when I bit. I asked the nurse for epidural. She was like, "Let me check your cervix and see." If you can, um, get the epidural, check it. Oh my god, the baby's had your 10 centimeters, yay! Alright, you can be, I just hit myself, y'all ain't see that. You can begin, um, pushing. I was like, I got a, I got a boo-boo. I was like, I got a boo-boo. And then I push, I was like, they was like, shit, oh my, they calling the nurses, the doctors, she's pushing, she's pushing, she's ready, she's ready. So I'm like, I got a boo-boo. Ooh, excuse me. <laughs> I got a boo-boo. <laughs> For real. So, um, she's, um, she's pushing my baby now, now, now. That's all they kept saying. So I'm pushing, I mean, I'm pushing. I was like, I got a boo-boo. They was like, okay, you ready to push her off? Uh-huh. So, they set me up. Put my legs up. Oh. Put my legs up. All that stuff. They didn't even hold my legs. If they had a little thing, I was like, yeah. But I had to grip it so I can push. So, I'm like, one, two. <laughs> they was like, ready? They was like, breathe. Push. Breathe. <gasps> Push. <sighs> I do that every time you have contraction. Push out five minutes, all natural. No ever doing no nothing. And they put it on my chest like this. Come here, come here, Brio. Come here, Zaya. They put her on my chest like this. I gotta change your diaper. Cause you're boo booing. They put her on my chest like this. She picks up the first thing I did. I'm like, oh my god, my baby. I started crying, y'all. 
you know what it is. If you see my Snapchat, put it on my Snap. And she was crying. I was like, don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry, mama, baby. Mama, baby, don't cry. It's okay. Uh -huh. And then they did all of that. And this is what she looks like. Bria. Hold on, y'all. Let me get her in the control. Because she is boo booing and she's. Yeah, my name is Jaya. I'm Jaya Bria, everybody. <laughs> Piggy boom boom. Piggy boom boom. My name is Jaya Bria, and I'm sweet. But my mommy's gonna talk for me. I don't know how to talk. And um, I was born December 15th, 2017, at 7.30. And um, I weighed 6.9 pounds. And um, I was 18 inches or 19. I don't know. My mom forgot. And um, yeah, my name is Ibrahim Peachy. And I'm the princess of my mommy. And I love my daddy. I take his money. And we go spend it, me and mommy. And we buy me clothes. And shoes. Right now I don't have clothes on because I do do. And I was hot. So yep, that's my labor and delivery story. I'm gonna be inserting pictures and all that. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Add me on Snapchat. Follow me on Twitter so you can see more of her and me. Say bye. Mama, tell them bye.